What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's Dan here. I want to welcome you guys back to NBA 2K20, my career. We are moving on now to the next one. Got a game against the T-Wolves. Let's handle our business. Let's go to practice first and do our thing. Here we go. And checking out Minnesota's opening lineup. On Land Towns, the duo inside. The tandem at the one and the two, Teague What is he doing here? What was that about? Why did he make Teague walk all the way up? Why not pass it to him? They don't usually do that. Four with Harrell in the middle. Then it's Williams. Then it's Paul George. And it's Quinn in at the point. Yet another player from the 2019 draft class. Who was it? A top high school recruit. Jared Culver, three star guy, thin, unrefined. But in that sophomore year of college, boy, did he surprise some folks. Oh, man, that looked good. It didn't look like he had that much contact. Now the Timberwolves with it. Oh, what was he going for there? But he still got control. Cat back. Cat back's and bricking it. Chances on that possession, but they just couldn't find a way to score. Out to the right wing. Here's Leonard. Oh, Easy bucket for Kawhi. That's Leonard. a murderous. And then Leonard dunk. enjoys jamming it home, Kevin. Got to keep him as far away from the hoop as possible. Oh, what a, a steal! Talk about Cole. The one thing he did show in high school, and again, nice lob, Kawhi. The ability to Man, this is awesome. Yeah, and he what a start. And makes shots against great defenders. Every team in the NBA is looking for that. His jumper, his handle, his ability to move. Strip, the ball. grab it. Already, NBA. Oh, Walden! I forgot about Walden. He was my guy in my story. T can't hit. Still can't get anything going here after three tries. Win. A shot on the assist by George. Yes, and how about the unselfishness? Paul George has no problem sharing the ball. Hey, check action. First 130 gone here in the first quarter. Man, I forgot about that story. They kind of like on think the about the stories in these games. Defended by George. Is that once they're done, they're done. You never really hear about them. There's no extra cutscene, which is kind of lame. A little late. Boy, the defense got lucky there with him missing it. But they don't want to chance that again. Culver's shot is off. Yeah, trying to get going here, but that's an offer for the first five here to start the game. Come on, man. Why aren't these perfect releases? I'll take them, but... Here they call A.W. What to like about his game, Greg? Uh, well, the Wolves took him with the 11th overall, and I, I was surprised he didn't go higher. It is rare to find a player with the upside that Walden has, and if he pans out, it could be a huge boon for Minnesota. But he, we'll see if he pans out. Now the Clippers with it. They've got I'm faster. Oh man. Oh, picking it up. Bam. Awesome dunk is one of the reasons this team is in charge of this game. Well, there's a swagger out there. You can see it on the court that they possess and are not afraid to show it either. Boy, and I used to love going up and jamming it down like that guy. Time out call first of the game for Minnesota. It's a good start, man. I'm liking the movement. Clark, talk about the types of insights those scouting reports would reveal about your team and your opposition. Typically, player tendencies and team tendencies. How do they win? What areas? Oh, are I'm really sagging so hard. Oh, but it, oh, the where's the box out? That's offense, brutal. Very physical. I mean, just those types of nuggets that you would have for a wow, team. Wow, he just kind of forced that one up and it managed to get a go. So that you could try to position them to not be at their best by what you did to counteract them. Good explanation. Why are you not dunking it? Some great timing that time from Teague, who was able to climb the ladder and get the shot block. Don't see that much from him, but pretty good work there. Towns with the bucket. And when the size advantage is as big as it was there, I mean, that's exactly what he's supposed to do in that situation. And the there you go, finally put it down. Queen's got six. And this organization sees a lot of potential in Axel Walden. They think, Greg, he could be a big part of their future. But you love the potential he has. A, a lengthy forward who moves so well. And this team is hoping that he can make the most of his frame and be a star. He's dribbling all over the place, it's Culver. And there's Still another one it. for the Timberwolves. And for me, guys, this is an area that Culver should utilize more often. Showing off that incredible feel with the jump. There you go, finally. The con I have contact finisher Hall of Fame, and it still sometimes doesn't pop out. Which team has the swagger right now. 
Well, you know what? You don't want to do too much to get an opponent riled up. You got to be mindful of that. Okay, get off of him, for God's sake. Here's Teague. He gets hauled in by Los Angeles. Well, I'll tell you what, he's going to buy himself a ticket Pop it. to the bench if he keeps shooting it like oh, that. He has been putrid that's here so aggravating. this quarter. To the left side wing. Back to Walden. Passes it to Culver. The kick out to town. Shot clock at three. It's kind of forced. The three. You know, he looks a little off kilter to me this quarter. Still trying to find nice. his Nice. Win. Good. I'm loving these mid range jumpers. Feeling it, guys. And the best game plan right now, it's elementary. Just keep feeding him. Let him eat. Now, here's Walden. His last outing, 16 points for him. Get it? Oh, I got it. Stole it. Lose on the corner and pop it in for three. Oh, he got rid of it. That was weird. It like it like threw him off and he's like, ah. It shook him off. And it's earned him Western Conference Player of the Month. And the way that he has been able to kind of create something out of nothing for his teammates has been. Oh, I had to turn remarkable. around. That was Fantastic slow. And timely passing combined with his vision is something that all players should aspire to have. I hate. There you go. I don't like how these mid race jumpers should be behind, but they're not going down. Change. Napier's checked in. Displaying intensity. I've noticed right I have a habit the opening of tip. my right Especially thumbstick feeling like it's perfectly in the middle, but I actually have it off to the side. The I've mentioned this before. Sometimes I feel like I have to bend my left stick uh, so that the jump shot feels like I'm shooting to the left and it's dead middle. They get it again. And he oh. gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. And the soft spoken Maguire is now an elite talent in this league. An athletic forward. Leads by example. Zubats is Zubats. checked in for the Clippers. Jermichael Green comes in for George. And then for Minnesota. Gorky Dangs checked in for Noah Vonley. Robert Covington comes in for Walden. And Wiggins is subbed in for Culver. Oh, what was that? Here's Napier taking a look Goodbye. at the scoring yeah. numbers. Right now he averages about nine points a game. And the Timberwolves call time here. Outplayed in the previous game on their schedule, losing to Sacramento. Scoring efficiency was an issue in that one. Took them too many shots to get their points. Yeah, and I think they just seem to be a page behind, a step slower. That's stolen. Reckless is checked in for Leonard. Pop it, Harkey. Don't miss. And he missed. Target from outside. I wanted him to run it. I would have chucked the law, but he didn't run it. I was annoyed about that. To start this game. Yes, yeah, Oh my God, this mismatch is filthy. But he doesn't take that option. Good offense squaring up against better D there. Got to appreciate that stop. Which pop and there you go. That's a better shot. From the wing. The defense looks soft early on. They've got to sum it up a little more sense. Stripped it. Urgency. Yeah, they've got to do a little more to disrupt their offensive rhythm too. Easy. Oh no. Beverly, what are you doing, Bev? Typically, he has the touch. To I can't believe it. When he's in tight, but not sure on that possession. Wig skis. Napier feeling it out of it. Oh, nice steal. With the steal. And pushing it up. Here's the Clippers. Beverly with the ball. There you go. I was not sure, but catch and shoot is too good. You didn't know. Axel Walden and Che were actually roommates in the summer leading up to the draft. Now they're both in the league and get to square off as competitors. Oh, strip them. And you know, Greg, there has to be a little extra motivation for both of them here tonight. Nice. Does it count? Shot right right in the face of a friend, right? And guys, let's get your take on the hustle stats for the Clippers. They've come out in attack mode on the defensive end. They've applied pressure and forcing turnovers. They also came out of the locker room with their running shoes on. I mean, that transition game has been full throttle. And Bam! The rules have done well Woo. over the past few seasons, taking care of the ball. Let them know out here. You know, they squeeze it well. Low turnovers can be a double-edged sword, though. If you don't make many mistakes, maybe you're not being aggressive enough. And oh, we got blocked. Got the board. Zubats. And, and offensively, he has been a liability more than he's helped this quarter. From 18 feet away. Yes. Off the glass that, time. that was so perfect. That had to happen. Boy, has he put his
his foot on the pedal here this quarter. He's doing a terrific job in terms of leading their offense. Now oh, here's Towns. He's oh, whoa, how am I supposed to get over to Covington? Are you serious? Yeah, and it seemed like Defensive break suck. My God. Free throws. Credit him That's for really silly, bro. It to the defense. From 15 feet away, and another. Once again, I'm too open, man. I'm at, like, I'm hot. I'm gonna be making these. Oh, this is the kind of start they. Oh, he stripped it, but he didn't get it. Shots falling off to a very good start offensively. As a result, here's Towns. He kicks to Jay. That one, no good. Clippers leading by 23. Here's Harkless. Yes. Again, what a shot. All in the first quarter, my dudes. And so Napier will bring it up for the Minnesota Timberwolves. Oh, how did I not get the steal on that one? Beverly against Wiggins. Back to Napier. The pass to Wiggins. Here's Towns. Oh, easy money for Cat back. Only the second time tonight. Now two for six from the field. What can you do when Towns is knocking these shots down? A big man with a dynamite killer. Oh, he's not going to be able to pop that. Here's Harkless. Whoa! He's got seven. Here's Wiggins. And it's Damn, Wiggins get out of Wiggins' gym. way. Way ahead of the field. He can do pretty much whatever he wants. You know, and not leaving anything to chance either. That's why he takes it right to the bucket. And yes, nice. It's good. They're doing a really good job of getting the ball inside. They're leaving the it, man. The paint. That's an area they have completely dominated. Well, once they Ooh. recognized the advantage they had inside, it made a lot of sense just to continue to attack that area. Here's Towns after the basket by Los I'm Angeles. I'm there. Oh, but he still got Ooh, it. Nice play there from Napier. Despite you the know, contest. You know, when he orchestrates for his teammates, Towns becomes even more valuable to me. Really good when the offense is able to flow through him. Now, here's Green. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. To the inside. Harkless with the, the double came. I pass it out. Eight of their last ten coming off assists. And Greg, you know nothing makes a coach happier than give me me selflessness on the basketball court. Stripped it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Nailing Got it. Another steal. And that's his sixth steal of the night. Imposing. Mm, right the before the end of the quarter, too. Really wow. The momentum of this game, but doing it with a that is filthy, man. Approach. You know, that what a first quarter. I can't even inside. believe it. Getting as many points as you can right at the rim. That demoralizes a team. And, so and phenomenal Angeles. points, too. Finishing the quarter up by a... The former number one pick overall in 2015, Carl... Every single day, we're thinking about how can we be the team. One step at a time, Greg. That's the mindset to have. Yeah, yeah, you can't have too much too early. But, but with Towns leading the charge, this team is in great hands. Oh, another windmill. And so far through one quarter, it's been a lopsided game. We'll see if that changes here in a second. Guys, it's oh, I approached him in the wrong side. Out there. Yeah, in that first period, they look to push in transition at every opportunity. Yeah, I like the way they play. They're looking to I'm get there. up and down the court every time. Racehorse basketball here tonight. Strap it up. Don't look down. You'll miss something. And so in the game for the Timberwolves. Whoa! Wiggins and Covington fill the wing. That was down weird. Low, it's Jang in town. And it's Napier in at the point guard position. Now here's Napier. After the miss from Quinn. And here's Napier. Takeover is almost done. Down to five on the shot clock. The Timberwolves need to get a shot off here. Shot from 12. Offensive rebound. Towns. And that's good. A nice job in the glass. And that's it. Up two on the second effort. Well, I like the way Towns reads where the ball is coming off when it's missed. And he's got excellent time All day. as well. And did a good job beating everybody to the ball. The defense not putting up any fight on the inside. They've allowed 10 straight points in the paint. That's not the kind of streak you want to be part of defensively. Tighten it up, fellas. Now, here's Covington. He's a good contributor to his team, averaging about 10 and a half Oh, he bricked it. The Clippers have gone two or three from the field here to open the second quarter. Oh, I'm a little... The young oh, it's money, though. Coach Brian Saunders. Son of former Minnesota coach Flip Saunders. 
about as great of a pedigree you could ask for as a young coach. Well, guys, you've heard. Oh, got that felt out of here. DNA when it relates to players, Ugh. it's the same with coaches. I mean, Brian has grown up. All right, his I'm dad still in. At a high level, the late Flip Saunders, one of our favorites in the business. Um, he spent his whole life around basketball, so he has a great way with players and a real good understanding of the game to a modern day approach for a young coach. That's my board. Update here, so let's catch up with David Aldridge. Popping it in well, for Shams, Peter, perfect. Lou Williams That's a Sham wow the right there. Three times sixth man of the year may be undersized, but he keeps finding angles to score. Williams said, I can't shoot straight up. I've always played crooked. It's weird, but it's something I've developed, fading away from guys. I have bigger defenders on me, and it's just about creating space. Kevin, even well into his 30s, Lou Will still does nice. it as well as anybody. Wow, we're already at I 10 totally assists. Agree, David. And we're just a few minutes good. into the second Thank quarter. A lot of ball movement happening here. They want to turn it around. Yeah, right now you just need a bucket to get some momentum. Nice ball movement by Minnesota. Here's Wiggins. Another oh, you got to let me get Minnesota. these boards, bro. And they've got a big lead, not just on the scoreboard, but really in the rebounding numbers as well. And what I like about it, Greg, is that is beautiful. Brand of basketballs. Had a that's the exact time to use a floater. To it. Gritty and, and rough, but that's how you win games. Here's Teague after the made shot from Quinn. Teague, the pass to Towns. To end the cold streak. Made Still that finishes. One, only his fourth of this game after firing ten times from the floor. Well, you gotta respect and admire the focus of Towns. I mean, he just doesn't get rattled. He just stays with it. Oh, I sent that out of bounds. My bad. And keeps coming. Conley, check in for oh, that's okay. I need to rest anyway. And uh, he's just had one attempt at the line earlier. And, How and we he's doing? There at Dominating. One from the line this season, probably below where you'd like to see him. A decent free throw shooter is Wiggins trying to become more than that, though, given how often he gets himself to the line. Los Angeles has gone two of four from three point range so far in the second quarter. Oh, mm, mm, mm. my goodness. And there's the slam dunk to finish it off. That's filthy. Oh, he is a highlight reel unto himself, guys. Uh, that could be. Oh wait, how did that go through me? That should have been a steal. Without question, a crowd pleaser. Oh, I got a foul. Degree. And a quick look at how the Minnesota Timberwolves get their first one in it. On Monday, they continue the road trip, heading out to Sacramento to take on the Kings. And then on Wednesday, the Atlanta Hawks come into town. That will tip off a home stand for them. And for that Raptors game. That's where you have got to bring your A game. As as oh, you know, God, I love that. Filthy Tommy. All night long. And the Timberwolves making a change here. Bell's checked in. The Timberwolves shooting under 40% all in all for the game. Stripped it. Grab it. Jang the pass to Napier. And he Try to get in there. In. They still considered it a breakdown. Napier's got eight points. And look, what I like there, Kevin, is the ball doesn't stop with Jang. I mean, he seeks out the best opportunity. Oh, I managed to squeak by. Haven't we seen that a few times today, guys? I mean, their defense has got to have a little bit more toughness about it. And if it doesn't, this is only going to get uglier. I mean, that's no way to defend a player of his caliber. And the Stripped Super it. Wolves what a timing. Oh, no, get it. After the basket by Los Angeles. Oh, we get it. One on one here. Oh, my God. That one's no good. Oh, I can't believe it. The game. Timberwolves shooting That's my seventh steal already. Percent from the field in the second quarter. Here's Napier. Eight points his last outing. Stripped Locked it. Loose. That's another steal. Here's Quinn. Cranes the 19th. Wow. Quinn's got 34 points. Eight steals, and too. Obviously, his momentum from the last game has carried over. Here tonight. And you know that's how it goes. No dice. These hot streaks, guys, don't last minutes. They last games, boy. Thanks so much, Dave, for the great interview. Don't go away, folks. We'll be back for the second half. Man, I can't believe I have eight steals in the first half already. That's crazy.
Well, we've got a second half of basketball for you. We think it's going to be pretty good. A big comeback, though, is needed for this game to be competitive. And All right, let's go, Ball Ball. Oh, whoa, he passes We're to me. A tremendous game from Quinn. Well, with a double double in hand through two. That's quarters. dirty. I didn't even mean to do any of that. I mean, I did, but I want I let go of my sprint, so he just did a layup, fancy layup. In his eyes tonight, and he's not going to start taking it easy. I think he's going to be going. Oh, cool! I got in that poster. The two stars, George and Leonard, fill up the forward slots. Then there's Harold. Then it's Williams, and it's Quinn at the point guard. That's the yep. five to begin the second half for Doc Rivers. And Clark, when you look at how the game has changed, if you were entering the league today, how would you reshape your skill set? Well, the biggest part would be expanding my shooting range. I was a good shooter at the time that I played, but would need to expand it and was just Lou. starting to stretch out my shooting. Oh, to the three that's always point disappointing. Line. And then also defensively, be a little more committed to that end of the floor, really working to get better there. But ball handling, passing, scoring, rebounding, those were things that I did pretty well. The kick out to T. Pass to Vonley. Five to shoot. Culver oh, he got rid of it in time. Williams, and Culver gets it to go on the assist, assist by Vonley. And how about the balance there from Culver? Really good at staying in control despite the D being all over. Towns against Harold. Here's Quinn. Yep. Again. All day, that little mini post. I'm sorry, that's poor defense. I improved my post fade as well. It's been a mismatch thus far in the paint. I'd agree with you, and I don't think they expected this one to be a game where they would get battered inside like they had. Kept alive. And they've won the rebound battle so far, and it's Lou. translated to the scoreboard. Or well, the effort level they've had Ooh. has been outstanding. Hard little Jay from Lou. Down when they play with that much energy. That's their third straight make off an assist. Stripped. Oh, I thought I stripped him. Holden kicks to Culver. I did. I poked it. The kick out to T. Oh, I'm nowhere near him. Here's Von oh, Lay. but they get it back. Lays wow. It off the glass. Von Lay's got his first basket. Really strong rebounding on the interior, and he gets the easy put back. Here's Quinn. Yeah. Oh, 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 yeah. And that one is stuffed right through. Ooh, that's an old-fashioned rim wrap. Uh, just a remarkable jam. These fans' jaws are on the ground right now. Platinum level highlight reel material. Oh, I was getting, oh, I lost my takeover again. I got greedy. I was trying to get those, uh, those steals. A little over two and a half minutes off the clock in this final half of. Play. I would have got it if I was smarter. My chances would have been better. Oh, what is he thinking? Love the fact that Paul George. Oh man, PG, careful. At both ends of the floor, he's a rangy defender who's extremely disruptive. Oh man, what happened no there? Work. Yeah, and he that had shot to be tangled up there with that patented crossover. Just couldn't convert the finish. Yet that's another miss for him. They're behind in this game largely because he shot so poorly. All day. Shots good by Williams. It's too nice easy. Pass here to set that basket up. Minnesota's gone 0 of 2 from deep to start things here in the second half. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've gone a long time without a bucket. Teague with a Man, I sag look. badly. And that one's on target from the wing. Teague's got seven. Outstanding vision from Carl Anthony Towns. Not only is he willing to give it up, but he's ready to There you go. Stomach, that was you know? mean. Guys, it's a one man show out there. I mean, he looks like he's willing to handle all of the offensive duties for his team. Culver passes to Walden. Culver in the corner. The 17 footer. The rebound by Quinn. Let's go. Quinn's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. They've shown some strength in the paint today. Their work on the boards has been impressive. Guys, that's putting it mildly. I mean, they've been absolutely dominant. Nice, Kawhi. Easy. Leonard with the bucket. He's got 11. I don't know what's happening defensively, but they're not putting up any resistance. I tell you what, it's, it reminds me of one of my college coaches who used to say, that ain't going to get it done. That's five straight baskets in the paint now. <laughs> 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 the 
Clippers have gone. Oh, I see a PG shooting here in the second half. Very strong. Greg, I'm just so impressed with the level of finesse and craftiness that Lou oh. Williams always Oh, man, played. I don't know. I didn't have You're it right. Kidding. You don't stay a perennial six-man-of-the-year candidate and at Williams' age without having more than a few tricks up your sleeve. He, he's so good in tight spaces and can find a way to get a shot up where others just have to kick it out. Here's Quinn. And he goes nice and simple. I mean, already hot coming into the game. Is it fair to say he's hotter? Well, that might be fair, Greg, but I wouldn't want to take away from what he did in that last game. I mean, let's just say it's a pretty nice run he's on, no matter how you decide to frame it up. Down low. Oh, I got a foul and one. Chance at the line for one more coming up. Yeah, you know, Kevin, some point guards will feel that contact and just take the trip I give to the, the ball. Line. I hate how they wait so long to give him the ball. determined to draw the foul and convert the shot. Catching up on the changes for Los Angeles. Zubats is checked in for Harrell. Murray comes in for George. And Landry Shamit subbed in for Williams. Minnesota also making some changes. Gorky Dangs checked in for Vonley. Robert Covington comes in for Walden. And Wiggins is subbed in for Culver. And so it's Wiggins with it. He'll bring it up for Minnesota. After this one, they're off to Sacramento to take on the Kings. That will conclude their brief I tried. game road trip. Able to Size finish mismatch, through obviously. there, Kevin. Wiggins with the broad shoulders and excellent body control. Nicely done. Outside for Murray. My Murray's three trains the three Beautiful. Point. Murray's got his first bucket of the game, and he's on the board for three. And, and no matter who it is, that kind Stripped of it. There's number nine. Going to get it done. Here's Quinn. Oh, and no end one. Free throws coming up. I tried to finish, but he was stuck with, with me, so. It's on Jeff Teague. Yeah, just Camera, did I improve my uh, free throw? I think so. Just off with the shot. Boy, with all the contact he drew there, Greg, that would have been a heck of a bucket. He nearly got it to go. A lot of smart guys playing in the NBA right now, Clark. Any that you see? Oh, there's my tenth. Be a great future head coach. That was a lazy. There are so many of them, Kevin. When you spend yep. time around guys, and what a play! Come on, man. Because their quarterbacks and wow. on the floor in many cases. Just um, got CP3. it. I don't know if he has a desire to coach. Cat wasn't looking, so I took advantage of that. Feels the game as a coach, and Mike Conley, I think he too has the uh, type of cerebral approach that to the was game filthy. that lends itself to coaching. I am so psyched with. about that. Why aren't they showing that well, I have a triple double steal? Like guys who can work that in between area really keeps the oh risky. Oh baby. Guys, I mean, with oh he missed it. Of size and touch, he's a real threat from mid range. Wiggins dishes to Jang. That balls. Nice feed that time from Wiggins. Wiggins has got three assists in the game. Quinn kicks to Zubats to the paint. Here's Quinn. Not even a challenge. Oh wow, as I break it. There, That's embarrassing. Inside. Here's Wiggins, and Wiggins throws it down. Yes. Unselfishness always admirable in a basket. Let me see something. Okay, yeah, I do have 10. I just want to make sure. Consistent at giving it up when one of his teammates is open. To the inside. There's fifth. No! Oh, I keep speaking too soon. By Towns. Wiggins passes to Napier. Oh, and I got a foul. Shooting foul. All these fouls are off, like, shooting shoot fouls. They're not even, like... Um, let's quickly check out the scoring breakdown here. They're not even reaching. Guys, their play close to the hoop has been great all game. They do, and you also see a lot of points Making dumb come off the dumb dribble mistakes penetration. Here. They've been aggressive on the bounce at attacking the defense. Quinn kicks to Shamit. Kevin Gelly passes to Murray. That one's off, still out of sync. Minnesota's gone 0 of 2 from deep to start things here in the second half. Covington I left him. Covington with so we're going on a bit of a Covington's slow stint here. Points. Let's change and that. It's always terrific when Covington gets going down in the paint. I mean, this guy can score the ball from anywhere on the floor. Down low, here's Quinn. Nice. And one. There's Spinny one. And it gives him 51. Making it look easy. And after really leaning on that three-point shot in the first half, seeming like they're uh, just getting away from it here in the second. More of the shots coming from the interior. Covington, the bounce pass. Fades. No good on the shot. That's a board for me. Time. 
Los Angeles has gotten fewer than half of their three pointers to go down tonight. They're four for nine. Quinn. Look at that. Good. Big miscommunication on defense. He recognizes it and quickly takes advantage. Boy, the defense looks shell shocked. I mean, they're on the ropes right now, on their heels. Towns kicks to Napier. Wiggins left side. Good D. The That's rebound. another rebound for me. Plus eight in the rebound differential. One more reason why they're in control. Yeah, double. Oh, I got stuff. Pop it, Murray. They've taken the initiative. They've played, Beautiful. I think, with more purpose so far. Yeah, how about the percentage they're shooting from beyond the arc here in the second half? Greg, no question about it. They found a nice rhythm from deep. Yes, doing yes. all he can so far, but they still find themselves trailing. And I'll take it. On the shot, so Everyone's quiet, though. It's going to be on Andrew Wiggins. Shooting for Los Angeles. Oh, and he makes the made it. Barely, Los though. Angeles making a switch here. Beverly's checked in. Both free throws good from Quinn. And just a better job of getting to the line here in the second half. Didn't get there once in the first. We didn't need to go to the line. Towns fires from deep. Quick three. They get it back. And here's Beverly. He brings it up for the Riff. Los Angeles Clippers. Here's Quinn. And the pitch yep. shot is good. Quinn's got Might well use it. points. Boy, what a quarter for him. I mean, he's found his rhythm, and he's really riding that wave right now. And the My bad. By Napier. And there's a pattern starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. Well, I agree with you. Four of their last five baskets nice. have been exactly 15. of that variety. Yeah, he's shown terrific control of the pace and the rhythm of this offense. You know, numbers don't always. Oh, tell I'm a little. Guy. I gotta this calm down. Do paint the picture There's here. no I mean, need for that. Everybody involved. Coming on the floor for your Clippers, Mo Harkless. Shot from the inbound, and the basket is good. All right, we have time and to make a shot. Nine points for Andrew Wiggins, and that's a nice play under duress. Wigan staying aggressive, sinks the contested shot. Damn, and I tried so my best. The Los Angeles Clippers holding an unbelievable lead. As I need four. I got to keep my. I have four rebounds, and I have a quad dub. But we'll take a quick that's still a tall order to get four. I know because I've gotten six in three and quarters. Let's take now this moment to so I've really got to step it up, and they're going to sub me. They're going to pull me out. I know they're going to pull me out. So I probably won't get quad dub. Right there. I mean, great decision. Rebounds are just so much harder to just get at this stage, you know. And they'd love to see every possession in this way. True team basketball. And there may not be a lot of drama down the stretch as we head into the fourth quarter. I'm probably going to take it easy on the steals. Our fourth quarter action on the way presented by... They got it? Oh, that's number seven. Oh, my God. Keep it going. And so in the game for the Timberwolves, Carl Anthony Towns is out there with... Harky. Money. And it's a Kogi in at the two. A Bulgogi. With the bucket. A Hoagie. How many times have we seen a possession like that from them today? Ending with a basket coming off a pretty pass. Well, when you look at the assist totals, heck, they've been clearly the better team. Basket, good. And you're going to take as many of those high percentage shots as you can get. Here's Quinn. He oh, I can't believe there's no foul there. And this game has his name written all over it. Greg, he's right on Towns. Phenomenal and offensive onslaught. Timberwolves shooting in this game, 45%. I, I, that would have been a great Quarter time to reach, but I'm not reaching right now. It. The Timberwolves working the ball around now. Oh, that's blocked. Here's McGruder. Passes to Harkins. To the middle. Oops. Got a piece of it. Here's McGruder. Oh, I'm sorry. Fourth quarter now. We're about Oh, I didn't know how I didn't get that steal. I was like right in the lane. Stripped it. And now the Clippers on the break. From deep. Connect. Oh! What a three. <laughs> 62. That was very deep. A remarkable performance from him so far. Now up on top. The pass to Okogi. 
Clark, when you think of athleticism, sagging, my bad. Talk about the change. He already turned around. We've seen in the league, say, since the 80s. It's dramatically different. I mean, there have been tremendous athletes through every decade of the league's existence, but it's gotten better with improved. Nice. Well, I'm just chucking up buckets. About the anatomy of the body and how to enhance its performance. But now it seems like great athletes are, you know, a dime a dozen versus eight to a dozen back in the 80s. Pass to Lehman. The feed to Towns. The 10 footer finds the target. Doesn't take a lot for Towns to catch fire. He's a confident, sweet shooting big guy. Can score on anyone from anywhere. Quinn passes to Risky. Magruder. Misses the layup. The Timberwolves have gone three of five here in the fourth. I'm quarter. nowhere near Quinn my man. He's coming out of the break. Oh, you got me on Inside, cat. Here's Towns. Banked in off the glass. Towns has got 20. We know he can score from outside too, but close to the hoop is where Towns makes his living. Here's Quinn. Oh, I don't he know what I was thinking there. Go. So Minnesota will take it the other way. Why are you put me on Towns? Well, it's not a smart in. play, Welcome. man. We've got about three and a half minutes gone here in the fourth. Oh, court. here's Towns. He That's another board for me. Angeles. Wow, that was lucky. Quinn's got rebound number eight here tonight in the game. He dishes it to Beverly. At the top of the key, Harkless. Here's Quinn. That was horrible. And again, no good by the Clippers. Sorry, I'm just chucking up Boy, shots. He's got to be kicking himself for failing to make that shot. That's money. Oh, it's number nine. Oh, my God, that's number nine. In Los Angeles, they've gone 4-7 from the field since the beginning of the fourth. All I can pray is that something happens. I need one board for a quad dub. Let's see if the 2K gods are on my side. Miss, miss, miss. Oh, my God, I did it! Quad dub! Are you kidding me? Here's Quinn. Quad dub! In the corner. Oh! And again, oh! And certainly they are not Dude. hesitating. Letting it I can't know. That was too here. perfect. I'm gone. I'll sign out. I'm fine with it. Sign me out. I got a quad dub. Oh my god. I've done it. Holy I didn't think I was gonna do it. I got four boards. What a game! So oh my! Win this one easy. This game may not have been the most exciting we've ever seen, but you have to appreciate just what a clinical wow. they put on. Uh, I know their fans appreciated it. I am, I'm shaking, bro. Just stretches of excellent defense. What a series of events! Cat missed that post fade. No one's in the ball. Oh, I cannot believe it. Look at that! Look at that shooting badge. Oh, man, I got like 18 assists, too. And if I wasn't messing around, man, I could have got way more points. But I am psyched. <sighs> Quad dub, ladies and gentlemen. It doesn't happen in every 2K, but I do it at least one time every couple of years. Man, I am I am absolutely psyched. You know they got to talk to me about that. Quadruple double. I hope they don't say triple the double and they actually say quad dub. Game show. Shaquille wow. O'Neal to my right. Kenny the Jet Smith on my left, right here in the middle. I'm Ernie Johnson. Uh, and a chance now to head down to the locker room for our post game interview. Hey, Shaq here. Not many guys in the league are triple double threats, but you put one up tonight, boy. Woo wee. Is there more where that came from? Now, come on, Shaq, man. You know what I'm trying to accomplish. That triple dub. Why don't they that's mention quad dub? Night, and that's why they give me so much freedom. They trust that what I'm doing out here, by design tonight, night, is going to be great. Plus, y'all in the media love talking about triple doubles, right? You love it. I'm not a media man, but yes, I do love it. And that's a wrap, everybody. Thanks for joining us this evening. For Shaq, for the Jet. For Kevin Harlan, chemistry went down. Sports crew. It's this going to my head. Johnson. We will see you again soon. I don't know why they don't work it in. Hey, Che, your shoe guy and his girlfriend are here, and she's apparently like the president of your fan club. And I guess he's shy now because he wants me to introduce you to her. So.
so here I am. Huh? That's my dude. Let's do it. Okay, great. Cool. Follow me. See, that took two seconds. Why would you just walk away? I love how they have these random stories. Pick and roll defense is crucial in today's NBA. Wow. Okay? How you approach it there it is, guys. Quad dub. I had a. It, sometimes it feels like I get close. Yeah, here we go. Look, I'm just saying, the best players in the league, your Steps, your Hardens, your Durants. Quad dub. That's some work right there, boy. I'm surprised there's nothing here. Congratulations, winning player of the month. You're competing at elite level, and that's a direct result of the countless hours of hard work we've put into our craft. We're proud of what you accomplished so far in the season. My pleasure. Are they giving me anything? Rookie of the month. Sort of fantastic. Player of the month and rookie. You know, we're all incredibly appreciative of your contributions to this organization, but we'd like to take it further. From now on, we encourage you to provide input on personal dire personnel directions, both big and small. See, on court later this team, you have a vantage point, and we don't. That we don't, and we want to capitalize on that. Anytime you have a thought regards to personnel, we want to hear it. It's partnership, and we want you to feel empowered. So what does that mean, personnel? Like, staff? You know what's cooler than a quadruple double? What? A quintuple double. That was predictable. Just joking, bro. Relax. Calmer than you are. Doesn't sound like it. So five five rows. I don't I I don't think I could ever do a quintuple double. That'd be insane. Quad, I'm cool with getting quad. Wow. Well, all right, ladies and gentlemen, I am on cloud nine and absolutely psyched about it. And we got that quad dub, and I can't believe it. Anyway, uh, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, do me a favor, hit that like button. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. If you haven't yet, be sure to like and follow my pages on social media, facebook.com slash Danky8000 for live streams and other content. Twitter, Danky8000, Instagram, Danky8000, and Snapchat, Danky8000. If you want to get yourself a shirt or a hoodie, link in the description. If you want to save 10% of your next DX Racer, link in the description. Be sure to use the promo code Danky8000 at checkout. All right, guys, thank you so much again. Take it easy. Have a wonderful day. I'll be seeing you soon for more content, but until then, let's add things over to Knox Hill. Have a good one, guys. So back, yeah, give me that bow in your lane like a track train. Give me that ah, hell nah, they ain't running like this. I'm a marathon bitch, man, the air is line act like a rock. We ain't moving, you know me, been chilling at the top. This the type of feel you only feel it when you hide. NBA 2K on the dot.